Hey guys, Connor from NiceWheels here in a beautiful day in Central Park here to talk about the Verge SA8i, a worry-free commuter bike. So in this video, we'll go through the really unique specs on this bike, how the bike feels while you're riding, and of course, how to fold it. So the most unique feature on the Verge SA8i is gonna be this Gates Carbon Belt Drive. Uh, so what you get with this is a super worry-free uh, drivetrain, no grease, uh, nothing's going to get on you here, and that's combined with an 8-speed Shimano Alpine hub in the back to give you enough gears to get anywhere in the city. The other features that make this bike perfect for city commuting is that it already comes stock with a rack and fenders, and this rack is actually the turn cargo rack, so it holds a little bit more weight than the portage rack that a lot of their bikes come with. So taking a look at the wheels on the S8i, you have these double-walled kinetics rims that are super durable. Uh, that in combination with Schwalbe Big Apple tires, so this is going to give you a really comfortable ride. Uh, that in combination with the wider wheelbase that the bike has, uh, so it's going to allow you to roll really smooth and handle the potholes just fine with the thick tires. And so the great thing about this stem is that it's fully adjustable, so you can open up these two levers here, and you have a full range of different riding positions. You can bring it all the way straight up or all the way down and forward, which is how I'd like it. So. I'm going to clip these back in here. This bike comes with a uh, hub, front hub dynamo to power the front light over here. So let's move to the shade to show you how that works real quick. So I'm going to spin the front wheel and that hub dynamo is going to power this light. Obviously the more you move, the light's going to stay on. And you can switch that on and off whenever you'd like. So to fold the S8i, you're going to want to drop the seat down, let that fall all the way. Do the middle frame hinge here fold the bike in kind of an N shape so those magnets in the back touch together. You can pull down the bars and you're going to strap it all together with this little uh, rubber strap on the frame and it's ready to store in your closet or apartment or under your desk. So it's finally a beautiful spring day here in Central Park so let's get this unfolded and ready to ride. See you guys out there. So like I said earlier in the video, uh, the Verge S8i is a super low maintenance bike and that's because of two major things. It's going to be the Gates carbon belt drive that we have on this in combination with a uh, Shimano 8-speed hub. So the hub actually gets you pretty good shifting, uh, really smooth, and you have no external gears, no chain to worry about, no extra grease, uh, pretty much nothing to stop you from using it every single day and barely having to bring it in for any kind of work. So for the daily bike commuter, this bike is pretty much perfect for you. Uh, the belt drive never wears out, uh, super durable. And believe it or not, you actually get some pretty good speed out of this bike, even though it is a little heavier than some of the other Verge bikes in the line. The extra wheelbase actually makes a pretty big difference in the, uh, the rolling for the ride. So you can get some good speed, even though it is a heavier bike. All right, so now we're on the streets of Manhattan to get the real test for the SA8i as the perfect city bike. We'll get around some potholes over here. Yeah, just a couple over there. The Big Apple tires makes a, a big difference uh, compared to a lot of uh, bikes with, say, thinner tires or just ones not as thick as these, even as many uh, as the other folding bikes that we do carry from both day on and turn. fight through some traffic here. Gonna still get pretty good speed. We'll pass up on these cars. So still able to pick up speed. Still gonna have a comfortable ride. Overall, this bike rides great. I mean, it's actually surprised me. I, I was a little worried when I first saw the weight of the bike being about 31 pounds. You know, I wasn't 100% sure about it just from looking at the specs, but once you do get onto the bike, you really feel the difference. Looks like the camera went a <laughs> little out of whack there from hitting so many bumps, but honestly, I don't feel a thing, so the bike's handling the bumps much better than the, uh, the camera is right now. The price of the bike being at 2100 uh, is actually really good for a bike with these components on it. Uh, you're 
A lot of bikes in the past have been about four to five thousand dollars that have the gates carbon belt drive. So for the price point and all the components you're getting on this bike, it's, it's pretty much a steal. Thanks for watching and be sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel for more future videos.